Hello everyone, so welcome to another Now Trend Tech video. So in this video, I'm going to show you how you can enable the drag and drop feature in File Explorer. So I'm using Windows 11 and, and the build version is 25290. So this is a hidden feature. So when the drag and drop feature is enabled in File Explorer, all I have to do is drag the tab on the desktop and it will open a new File Explorer. So right now it's not enabled. So to enable this hidden feature, I need to download a file. So you want to go to this site, it's GitHub, and you want to download the Vive tool and this is the latest version here I'm gonna click on latest it's a zip file so I'm gonna click on a zip file it's here I'm going to show in folder so I have to unzip this file and place it in the C drive so I'm going to open the C drive so I'm going to unzip this file and place it in the C drive so I'll just drag it into the C drive select extract click extract and the folder is extracted here. I'm going to rename it. So I'm just going to rename it Vive Tool. So I'll go to Command Prompt. I'll right click the Start menu, click Search, type CMD. So I'm going to right click Command Prompt and run as administrator. So I'm going to type CD, C, hit Enter. So I'm in the C drive. So now I'm going to go to the folder. I'm going to say CD, and the name of the folder is Vive Tool. Hit Enter. So I'm going to paste this command. So this is the command and it says enable. I'm going to hit enter and it says successfully set feature configuration. So I'm going to restart this computer. So I restarted my computer. I have File Explorer open. So to test the feature, I'm just going to drag this tab, pictures tab, on the desktop window. So it opens a new File Explorer. I'll drag the documents tab on the desktop and it opens a new file explorer window. So this is a great feature and this is a hidden feature that's in Microsoft Bill 25290. So if you want to disable the feature, all you have to do is replace this enable with disable and the feature will be disabled. So I hope this video was helpful to you. I thank you for watching and I thank you for subscribing.